Honor to send the best wishes of the people of the United States in advance of the 34th African Union Summit. This past year has shown us how interconnected our world is and how our fates are bound up together. That's why my administration is committing to rebuilding our partnership around the world and re-engaging with international institutions like the African Union. We must all work together to advance our shared vision of a better future, a future of growing trade and investment that advances prosperity for all our nations, a future that advances lives of peace and security for all our citizens, a future committed to investing in our democratic institutions and promoting the human rights of all people, women and girls, LGBTQ individuals, people with disabilities, and people of every ethnic background, religion, and heritage. To reach this future, we also must confront the serious challenges we face. That includes investing more in global health, defeating COVID-19, and working to prevent, detect, and respond to future health crises, and partnering with the African CDC and other institutions to advance health security. Raising our climate ambitions and ensuring developing nations can mitigate and adapt to climate impacts that are already causing pain. And engaging in sustained diplomacy in connection with the African Union to address conflicts that are costing lives all across the African continent. None of this is going to be easy, but the United States stands ready now to be your partner in solidarity, support and mutual respect we believe in the nations of Africa, in the continent-wide spirit of entrepreneurship and innovation. And through the challenges ahead, although they're great, there is no doubt that our nations, our people, the African Union, were up to this task. I hope I can be with you next time in person. I want to thank you, though. Thank you. May God bless you all.